right guys, so it is, uh, this is Amy and Zoe Baxter. I don't even know my name anymore today. Um, it is day 29 of NaNoWriMo. So I am about to pack up my computer because I'm planning to go to my last write-in for the month today. Hopefully somebody will be there. If not, I'll just write at the Starbucks. Um, but it's after work, so like right after work. So that should, I don't have to wait around or be by myself for a while. You know, it's not the point. You're supposed to go have fun. So I'm going to go do that today and hopefully I can write my, I think I just need like just under 1900 words and then I got my 50k, which will be awesome. So, um, I still think the story is going to be at least five to 10 more beyond that, but we'll see how that goes. Anyway, I'll, I'll try to finish that up in the next week. Hopefully next weekend. <laughs> we'll see. So, um, anyway, that's kind of where it's at. I am taking a book that I haven't started yet. So I'm going to, uh, I don't know, I guess I'm going to, I'm ready to start going back to fiction. I'm just, um, I've done a really good job on my, whoops. I just went all dark. Sorry guys. That was not well planned. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, that's not going to work either. Well, we all learn these things all we, woohoo, light. Anyway, um, I was trying to do too many things at once cause I need to go. Um, cause again, I'm running late. I slept better last night, but just not as, it's still not great. Anyway, um, what was I saying? Oh, I was going to say, I don't have the book here right here. I, I'm going to start reading, uh, what is it? What is that book? I don't even remember the name. Okay. Oh, it's for my book club. Sorry. as my brain fries and it's the long way to a small angry planet. We uh, need to read this by December, I think the 12th. So I'm going to start it. I'm ready to start fiction. And since I'm almost done with Nano, I figure I'm safe. <laughs> Guess we'll find out. Anyway, so that'll be reading on my breaks. And then, um, as I said, I'll go to a write-in afterwards. And then, then tomorrow I should hang out with my aunt and I won't have to write. And I might write a little bit when I get back just to have some words on the last day. But I don't have to write much of anything, which is the whole goal for my trying to get ahead here at the end. So we'll see what happens. So I will check in with you guys later. It's probably going to be around five o'clock tonight when I go to the ride-in. Okay, later. Bye. Okay, super quick guys. I made 50,000. Woohoo! I did 18... 40 words, uh, so uh, I hit over 50,000 and 19 words, so hopefully that'll be fine when I do the validation when I get home. I don't wanted, to, I was at Starbucks and didn't want to uh, upload to their internet. So I'll do it when I get home. I'm gonna go grab something for food because I'm starving and I just had a coffee and uh, my stomach's empty and I just had that coffee. So um, not that it's a bad thing, I just meant I am hungry now. So, um, hey, I hit my 50,000 on, on today, on Wednesday. So I still have one day left. So tomorrow I just have to write a few words um, cause the story's not done yet. As I said, I probably have about 5,000 to 10,000 words left. I'm guessing I'm closer to five now. No, no, the way I write and wrap things up, it'll be 10. <laughs> so I'm hoping in the next week to finish that off, but I did finish NaNoWriMo. So I don't know if you guys will be able to see this. I will either redo this when I get home or, uh, or this will be in there. Sorry, it's really bad and dark and it's 6.30, so an hour and 15 minutes and I finished. Yay! Anyway, I will see you guys in a little bit. Bye. Hey guys, so <laughs> from my last little part of the video, you can see I made my 50,000. Um, I showed I had 50,019 words. Uh, the validator showed I had 50,043. So, okay, so I have a few extra words, no big deal. But um, anyway, so I won Nano. That means I've written over the 50,000. The novel is not done. As I said, I still think I have some more to do. So I will um, probably continue writing at least through the next weekend. I'm hoping to wrap it up. Um, I'm probably, as I said, not gonna write too much tomorrow, but I'll probably write just a little bit so that I've written for 30 days in a row, which will be pretty cool. So uh, beyond that, that is so cool. I'm so happy. Um, I did on my way home from Starbucks is 
finished uh, the last of Killers of the Flower Moon by David Grant. Um, I really enjoyed that audiobook. It was an odd format for it because it had three narrators. One did each part. I know why they did it. It just, it was, I wasn't expecting it, I guess. So um, it was kind of odd, So, but I did like it overall. And again, it's my kind of, a lot of the hist nonfiction I do like is history. And I like stuff that has to do with, um, that has like a crime element. But I also like it when it's, it's talking about a whole lot of other things uh, within culture and stuff and in the time period. So I am excited that um, I finished that as well. So I technically I did, I finished six things for uh, nonfiction November. So that's pretty good. I still have the book, um, you know, the book about books on that. I'm probably, I'm still only about halfway through and I don't know if I'm gonna, I'll probably have to finish it in another week or two because uh, to do back at the library, but um, that's the only one I'm gonna leave unfinished. As I said, I'm taking back the other book that I started. But other than that, I think I, doing six nonfiction books in the month is really good since I barely do one every couple months. So I think Nonfiction November was a success during NaNoWriMo. For me, that worked out really well. I had really cool audiobooks in my car every day, which was really nice. And then, um, and I had books that I read at night when I was done writing. So instead of, um, you know, reading fiction and reading somebody else's finished work, that would upset me <laughs> because mine is so raw. Um, nonfiction is so much easier to handle because they're go, oh, they research stuff. I don't do any of that. <laughs> So uh, anyway, uh, so me and the kitties are, uh, sorry, I showed a kitty butt there, sorry. <laughs> uh, we're gonna hang out here for a little bit longer. I have the laundry going, cause I need clothes for tomorrow. Anyway, um, and it's early day, so I'm gonna go to work early. So, but tomorrow will be my last vlog. So uh, I'm gonna wrap up this one uh, to right now. And as I said, I'll put up one more for tomorrow. Just kind of, I might, I might come back and uh, just kind of do kind of a wrap up of the month for what's going on. I don't know. We'll see what I do. Yeah, I don't know. It'll be uh, the last day so I could do anything. So um, now I'm just getting rambly and tired. So I will say goodnight. Happy reading to all. And uh, hope you, if you guys were writing, that you did really well this month. I am so glad that I, I got my 50000 on the Wednesday. Um, as I said, it's just been great because I haven't written much at all this year. And I feel so much better by having to, to write. Even if this story is not the story that I really wanna tell, it was a fun story and I'm getting it out and then I can move on to something else. So that's all good. So, okay, well, I will talk to you guys later. Okay, bye.